everyone, it's Miss Crystal. Today is How To Tuesday, and I have a deck of cards. So I was thinking of things that I could do with a deck of cards, and one of those things is playing Go Fish. So I'm going to teach you how to play Go Fish with my friend Miss Kelsey. First, I shuffle the deck, and I'm going to give seven cards to each of us. You can play with any number of people, but today it's just going to be two. Okay, so I have passed all the cards, so we each have seven cards. The first thing that you would do is see if you have any matches, if you have any numbers the same. As you can see, I don't have any numbers the same, so I'm going to keep all my cards. But if I had two eights, I would take those cards and put them to the side, because the goal of Go Fish is to get matches. You can play by either getting all four numbers, because in a deck of cards there should be four of the same numbers, but I'm going to play today just with matching two of the same number. After I passed out all the cards, I put the rest of the cards in the center where we are playing. You can spread it out like a river or you can just leave it um, like a stack. Okay, so the person to the left of the dealer goes first. Um, there's only two of us and since I dealt the cards, Miss Kelsey is going to go first. And we want to get as many matches as we can. So we're going to take turns asking each other if we have a match. So, do you have any fours? Do I have any fours? I do. So, I'm going to give my four to Miss Kelsey. Oh. Now she has a match. Since she got a match, she gets to go again. Do you have any sixes? I do not have any sixes. And since I don't have any sixes, I want to tell her to go fish. So then I'm going to draw one from the pile. And now it's my turn. Hmm. Miss Kelsey, do you have any queens? Go fish. Okay, so since Miss Kelsey told me to go fish and I caught an eight and I already had an eight in my pile, that means I have a match. Okay, so to finish the game you have to run out of cards and even if the river is gone you still have to get rid of all the cards in your hand. Um, so then you would just keep asking each other if they have a certain card until you run out of cards com completely. And once you run out of cards then you're going to count how many matches that you have and the person who has the most amount of matches wins the game. So let's see who wins. So now we have counted how many pairs if we have. I already counted and I have five pairs. Kelsey? Eleven. Ah! <laughs> Kelsey won.